I used to have a job I was employed as an insurance agent for a while, and that means that it's my job to listen to people complain all day. I had people call me all the time, I worked in a call center, and they're like, you know, calling all the day, complaining. I can't pay my bill. Your rates are too high. I don't even know you. Why are you in my kitchen with the lights off? <laughs> I might have a problem. <laughs> I had this one guy call me though one time and he's, he gets on the phone and he's like, well son, I'm 42 years old and I just think I'm paying too much for car insurance. Let's see what we can do about those rates. I put the guy on hold, I look over his policy and the last year the guy has two DUIs. Two. Dos. That's Spanish for two. I've been watching a lot of Dora lately so I'm picking that shit up. <laughs> Fuego. <laughs> I get back on the phone, I'm like, well, sir, thanks for holding. I think I got a great idea to get your rates down. Why don't you stop drinking and driving, asshole? <laughs> really, you just call me and ask me that question with two DUIs? Really, two? Everybody knows that DUIs are bad. Third graders know that DUIs are bad. I don't know why they need to know that, but they do. <laughs> Daryl, you just had three Mountain Dews and an entire bag of Skittles. You might not want to get on your Huffy for a couple hours. <laughs> Daryl don't care, though. He's a badass kid. Throw Skittles to the wind. <laughs> Fun times. I was living with a chick for a while, had a baby. Hate babies. Sidebar. Um, but this baby was cool, like the only cool kid that I've ever liked in my life. Except for one time, he woke up from a nap, the kid was in a terrible mood. I'm like, Liz, what's wrong with the baby? She goes, I think he had a bad dream. Really? Babies are having bad dreams? If you're a baby, what are you dreaming about that is so terrible? Wish I could talk to him. What's going on, Ryan? Had that dream again, Matt. Where that hanger just kept poking me in the face. <laughs> it's an illegal abortion joke. Right? <laughs> Sometimes you have to explain these things. <laughs> From abortion jokes to baby jokes, let's keep this bitch rolling. <laughs> My 12-year-old cousin, I was on the phone with her the other day, and she told me that there is a 12-year-old girl in her middle school that is pregnant. 12 years old, six months pregnant, and everybody in my hometown feels bad for this little girl. I don't feel bad for this little girl at all. I feel bad for that baby's father, because now he can't teach at that middle school anymore. <laughs> Don't get offended by that. That was his passion, and she was a whore. Twelve and pregnant. That's ridiculous. Yeah, I can't even say that with a straight face. I just want to watch that episode of Maury. That's all I'm saying. It's going to be a good one, and I'm home in the afternoon. Let's make it happen. I met this lady the other day. Nine kids. She had nine kids, man. Nine chilling. That's black people for children. <laughs> Fluent. Nine kids. I got to talking to her, and I'm like, you know what's cheaper than raising nine kids? Condoms. Just throwing it out there. Doing my part, you know? But apparently her husband was Mexican, so the yard must look fantastic. <laughs> it's not a racist joke. It's a free landscaping joke, so get with the program. I'm not having kids though, not me. Not nine, not any, because kids are selfish. Especially when it comes to television. I said I was dating that girl, and that kid would hijack the TV every time he was home. All day long, we'd have to watch that show, Dora the Explorer. I hate that show. Hate it. All day long, Dora. When the kid wasn't there, porn, because that's how I roll, bitches. <laughs> it was Dora or porn. Dora or porn. I was just waiting for him to combine the two so we could watch TV together. You flip it on, there's Dora getting railed from behind by Swiper. She's talking about, let's count my orgasms. Uno, dos. Swiper, no anal. Swiper, no anal. You guys, that's all I got tonight. My name is Matt Sorrentino. I'm hilarious and you enjoyed me.